Hello everyone, I'm your host, Boss Zombie. Welcome back to Pokemon Sword. Are we gonna fight Hop? Is that what's gonna happen? Look, there's the professor. So, have you unraveled all the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon yet? Oh goodness, no. The whole thing, thing is still full of questions. I'd hoped that my granddaughter would take over my research, but... Dear me, I'm sorry. I didn't even notice my guests. My name is Magnolia. Welcome, young trainers. Come, now come, let's head indoors. I like your Corviknight staff. Or cane, I guess that, what that would be. Why, Hop, dear. I see Willow has made some new friends. And you must be Matthew. I trust you received the Pokédex from Sonya. I'm sure you'll have it complete in no time. You must already know about Dynamaxing, right, Matthew? Professor Magnolia has been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years. It's probably associated with the legendary Pokemon in this region, like every other weird feature in the past two generations, three including this one, but let's not get into that. And it takes a proper understanding of the thing if you plan to use Dynamaxing to the fullest. There you go again, Leon, always talking about Pokemon. There are other things that are worth knowing about too, you know. Like how many different types of tea there are. Hey, Professor, do us a favor, would you? Help me convince Lee he should endorse for the gym endorse us for the gym challenge. Oh, Leon, why wouldn't you endorse them? And Hop Matthew only just started out as Pokemon trainers. There's still loads they don't know yet. Dear, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the Galar region become strong trainers, isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. The goal's precisely the reason I gave them both Pokemon, in fact. Right then, uh, right then. In that case, how about this? Let's see if the two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. And don't worry, I'll make sure both your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. Thank you, quality of life improvement. Right, I'll be waiting outside. Oh, you're not even fighting me here at the spur of the moment? I like your E-fridge. <laughs> your smart fridge. You have a choodle. I've been butchering those things. Do what plants would do what plants would want instead of what you would want? If you keep that in mind, plants will grow. Yeah. No shit. Thank you for your Well, they're not words of wisdom, they're just words. That's a lot of books. That's a lot of pink. Oh, I guess this would be Sonya's room given the amper stuff and goodness. It's quite a boudoir. Okay, Yamper has a nice bed at least. Oh, it's... Well, it's not nighttime in real life, but it's nighttime here. Is there a secret back here? <gasps> oh, is that a TM? Hey! Not a great one, but one nonetheless. Ah, an item. I like that they glow. It makes them real stand out. <gasps> a great ball. If I had had you, I would have wasted on the zigzagoon. Hello. A bottle of fresh water. It's like a better potion. Water is better than medicine, kids. Remember that. Hurry up, hot. <laughs> Hurry up, Matthew. You've got a battle so I can get myself that endorsement. I'm about to end this... Well, he's not a man. This kid's whole career. I'm going to become the best trainer there ever was. And to do that, I need, to take, I need that endorsement to take part in the gym challenge. Come at me with everything you have so we can prove to Lee we've got what it takes. All right. I'm rather interested in seeing how you two young trainers battle, too. Listen, you two, the reason I'm unbeatable is because I learn from every battle I see or take part in. That's how I've gotten to where I am today. So show me something good in this battle. It's time for my legend to begin. Let me guess, you have three Pokemon now. 
<gasps> Who would have known? Have you gotten a bit stronger? Me and my team will put you to test and see. Well... 14 and 6, huh? Yeah, you might, you might. I might be a little stronger. I might be a little stronger. Hey. Uh, rookie D. Yeah, sure. Well, I'm hoping Yamper has an electric move. Or oh, has Nuzzle. Does Nuzzle do damage? Or is it one of those weird ones? It does do... Oh, it's very weak. Oh, but it's a guaranteed paralysis. Okay. Yeah, sure. Yamper can take things on. And someone else gets some experience. You are so damn cute! Oh no, the berries I don't have. Oh, Yamper, you're not very fast. Well, look at you. Seems like you really learned your type matchups. Ooh, I like... Ooh, that sound effect for Paralysis was nice. Bye. Not as much experience, but still good. Uh, Sobble, well, I'm gonna switch back to Rookie then. Come to think of it, I didn't. There were no fighting types this early, so I guess the Wulu you couldn't have a type advantage over. That's fine. Monkey! It'll be a close one, but that's exactly my sort of match. This ain't close, this isn't close at all! You've done one point of damage to me. Have some leaves. You need more fiber in your diet. Hey, we got two level ups. Very nice. Very nice. Ugh, gutted that I lost, but I expect nothing less from my rival. Thanks for the money. I even got my Pokeball throw perfect too. The sting of defeat and the joy of victory. I guess I'm going through both. I guess going through both is the key to the two of us getting stronger, right? Cutscene? No. Yeah, kind of. Matthew, hop. Well, after seeing a match like that one, I suppose I have little choice but to give you both as an, an endorsement as champion. I think, you know what, I'm fine with the leggings, the shorts that I can't stand. They're so weird. Yes, thanks, Lee. I swear I'm gonna win my way through the gym challenge to reach you. You may both be young still, and plenty rough around the edges, but it was a proper battle. Charizard and I were both feeling the excitement in every last cell in our bodies. Hop, you've always tended to get caught up in things like how you throw your Pokeballs out. Things that have nothing to do with real strength. Honestly, I'd have been worried about you still obsessing over that sort of nonsense. But it seems you really have grown a bit, little brother. And I'd like to see some more thrilling Pokemon battles out of you too, Matthew. Alright, Matthew. You and me are going to train up against one another to aim for the champion's title. Yeah, I will not be training against you. You're weak. The more we keep battling against one another, the more Pokemon will grow. That is technically true. Huh? What's that? Um, would you look at this? They're wishing stars. <clears throat> nah. <clears throat> ah, what's going on? Since there are two of them, you should take one yourself. Oh, aren't these the things for, like, raids? Uh, says dreams come true. Yeah, I think you use it for... Maybe not. With one of these, my Pokemon can dine up. Oh, never mind. They're going to be massive. Yes. Trust you to pull something like this. They say wishing stars fall down for those who have a true wish in their heart, you know. I'll be the greatest trainer ever. 
I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. There, I've said it three times, so surely my wish will come true now, right? Don't be silly, Hop. Those wishing stars are composed of a curious sort of rock containing unknown power. They are one of the most precious resources we have here in the Galar region. Galar? I keep saying Galar. Galar! But they won't do a thing for you in that state. Give them to me now and I'll have you sorted. Ah, right. I've done heaps of research on the Dynamax phenomenon. I haven't... Oh, you've done. Haven't you, Professor? And please give Matthew and me the power to Dynamax our Pokemon. First, we got a battle against that mad Pokemon in the slumbered wall. Still don't say that word either. And now this... It really feels like we're getting caught up in the adventure of a lifetime. <clears throat> I do understand your excitement, young man, but don't get carried away. You want to save your energy for tomorrow's journey. But you're here now. <clears throat> now I need to clear my throat. Seems I came back home right in time for all the excitement. Hey, you lot. Why not have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I've been totally obsessed with making you the latest trendy curries. Oh, okay. Curry. That's a thing. It's morning at last. I'm time for our adventure to truly start. Good morning to you, young challengers. Hop, is it true that you really met some Pokemon you didn't recognize? Is there anything more you can tell me about it? Uh, well, there was a weird heavy fog, and then this even weirder Pokemon appeared. Matthew tried to fight it off, but I think we both passed out or something. It's all pretty hazy. A right fountain of information you are. Matthew, Hop, these are for you. Here are your MacGuffins. The Dynamax band, yay! I'm almost tempted to not even use this the whole game. <laughs> <clears throat> a power spot, what does that mean? These are your Dynamax bands. I made them by fitting the wishing stars you found last night into those bands. Thanks, Professor, this is brilliant. It's just like the one Lee has on him, too. Now we can Dynamax our Pokemon like he does. My word, you don't waste any time, do you? I think you'll find it's not so simple as that. There are a number of conditions you must meet if you hope to have your Pokemon Dynamax to take on that gigantic form. Now, don't be afraid to go all sorts of places and meet all sorts of Pokemon. That will help fill out your Pokedex, too. The Legend of My Reign is finally about to begin. Come on, Matthew. I'll beat you to the station. What is this? Interesting. Why is that my... I don't want that to be... I don't want that to be my... Icon? I hate that. Oh, I don't like a lot of the... Oh my god. Grass, water, fire. That's just... That's the face... Okay, never mind. Fighting, ghosts... Fairy, rock, ice. Wait. One, two. Wait, Dark Gym and Team Yell use the same icons? Isn't that kind of spoilers? There's clearly a connection there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, so it tries for both. So the other ones. Oh, these are all spoilers. Why is that a thing? Weird. Um. Yeah, sure. Give me the crazy artist. I'll take that. He's terrifying. Stamps. Oh. Link trade? Oh, that's just local trade. What am I doing? Wait. Stop. I want to stop. I don't want to trade anymore. No, get away, Icon. Uh. Oh, 
I guess that's just gonna be there. That's annoying. One thing before we race, Matthew. See, I've got some great advice for you. You seem to see a Pokemon wandering about out of the tall grass, right? Yeah? If you move real slow like and crouch down, those Pokemon won't pay you any notice. But on the other hand, if you whistle at them, they'll be sure to catch your attention. If you're a bit rubbish at whistling, just remember, you need a fail-proof trick, press the left stick. Try it out, let's see if we can catch the most Pokemon. I'm probably ahead of you already. Remember Wedger Station, right? Where we went to pick up Lee before? That's the goal. That'll be the goal. See you there. So see you there. God, I'm just... Ugh. How are words? Oh. I... Really? I spent so long looking for you last episode, and now you're just right there. Oh, well. Disappointed? Maybe I should have just caught that one. Why is there just a random Yamper here in the not grass? Yeah, you're a total wild Pokemon. Why? What? Why? Oh, you're level 8 Yamper, too. It's just like a special spawn? Oh, wait, Popo. Oh, another... Okay, I guess they can just spawn anywhere in the route, not just in the... This thing needs to go away. It's really annoying me. Do I have any stamps? Can I block myself? Wait. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's just there, huh? That's... I hate that. Oh, can't you... Oh, don't do that pose. Oh, the thing's gone, finally. Wait, can I... Sp That's dumb. Hello. Cool. Gah. I saw Hop sneaking off towards the station. Thanks for no information. Come on, Matthew. You'll never beat me to the station at that pace. Well, yeah, if you lock me in with this cutscene. So, out with it, Matthew. How many did you catch? I got a really special one. You got... Not one? What are you doing this whole time? You're gonna want a team if you're a trainer. Thanks for the TM. That's a technical machine. A TM, mate. A TM like that, you can teach your Pokemon to move, move in a flash. And you use them again and again, too. That one can teach you to move swift. Lee gave it to me ages ago, and now it's yours. The gym challenge will begin in Motostoke. And our training's waiting too. Let's go. Moto Stoke? Hop's mum. Not quite so fast, you two. What are you doing here, mum? I knew this day was coming since the moment you chose Sabo as a partner, darling. You mean. This day was coming as in it yesterday? You knew this day. You knew today was coming? Congratulations! Professor Magnolia was kind enough to let us know that you two were setting out. So here, a last little gift to see you well set on your way. All the kit you'll need for camping. Cool, thanks. Wild area or camping spot? 
No matter what happens out there, if you and your partner are together, I know you'll be fine. Thanks, Mom, and just think of how lucky you are. Mother of the first ever pair of champion brothers. Because I'm certain to be the next champion. Or champion next. So you'll see. Of course you will be, darling. Anyway, do have fun and take care of yourselves. Wow. She just brushed that right off. You'll be welcome back home anytime. Wish us luck. Not that we'll need it. There are loads of really trainers and all kinds of Pokemon out there waiting for us. Mike Sutton's running ahead of me even faster than the train can go, Matthew. Come on, we're off. Is that a phone? Motorcycle is surrounded by a vast wild area. It's a real sight. There's all sorts of wild Pokemon just wandering about everywhere you look. Plus, you can camp out, do a spot of fishing. I don't think I could ever get tired of it. Okay. Hello, angry eyes. Hey, Mr. Station Master. Isn't this the wild area? What are we stopped here for? Yes, this is the wild area station, make no mistake. I'm sorry to tell you that the train is halted due to a flock of Wooloo on the tracks. What's there to be sorry about? This is brilliant. What is? The wild area is massive. There are loads of Pokemon to battle here. You get it, don't you, Matthew? Th this is the best possible place to put together the greatest team. Is it, though? Oh, wait, the floor. These are all the Gigantamax main ones. Pikachu, Machamp, Butterfree, Gengar, Kingler... Jarzard. Hey, have you and Eevee had a... I knew it. You've had a Let's Go... Exp oh, wait. Oh! That's how you get this. This is an Eevee that can Gigantamax. No. I don't want to put it in my party. Only if there was a new Eevee evolution, this one can't even evolve. <clears throat> Wait, Dynamax? You mean Gigantamax. And you have the Pikachu. Alright, well I have both, so... Oh, wait, I have to get the Meowth. You can get a Meowth through, like, Mystery Gift or something. Yeah. Uh, Mr. Man? No, nope, I don't want to sit next to the stranger. I would like to talk to the stranger. Seems my children are giving something to people who've had a Let's Go experience. But what in the world is a Let's Go experience? you have any idea? Yes, I do. <gasps> Swine up! You'll run a stronger wild Pokemon the farther you go into the wild area. If you feel like you're in a pinch during battle, just use a Poke Doll. Oh. No matter how strong a Pokemon is, you'll be able to catch it eventually, so long as you join the gym. That's right. Uh, do you sell. You, you sell Pokeballs! How many do I have? Give me another 10. Oh, right, Premier Ball. This map is a little tough to read. Uh, okay. Yikes, Aroni, it's a big one. Oh, I'm, I've, I've disappeared into the Aether. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? Sure. Look at that. What am I looking at? That's Motostoke. Motostoke, way off that way. And between there and here are countless new Pokemon waiting to be met. Oh, hello, and if it isn't Sonya. My grand gave me a proper earful in her own way. Those two young children are setting out on a journey, but what are you doing with your life? Ah, uh, never you mind that. Nothing to worry yourselves over. Besides, I've been quite curious about that Pokemon you two met in the, fir in the forest. I've been thinking I should look into it so the timing works out fine. If I discover something really huge, then maybe even Gran will admit I got some talent. Yikes, being an adult has its own challenges, eh? I say you don't needn't worry about it. I'm glad to be on the road. Really, it's been ages. It'll be great fun to fish and camp and rough it outside again. 
Well, I'm off to go stick my head in as many of those red glowing dents I can find. I'm gonna battle the snot out of a bunch of Dynamax weapon and fill in another page in the tale of my legend. I don't know that I'll spend a lot of time. Oh, cheek. Dynamax Pokemon are really on another level, you know? You'd better Dynamax your partner Pokemon, too, if you want to take on opponents that strong. You'll find spots here and there in the wild area that emit a red beam of light. If you think you're up to it, check them out. There'll be Dynamax Pokemon lurking inside. So with that, how about I send you off with a little treat from me? Oh, this is the thing I can check my Pokemon box. Pokemon box link, you'll be able to put your Pokemon from your team into your boxes or take Pokemon from your boxes and add them to your team. Nice, right? So go wild catching as many Pokemon as you like and fill in some more of your Pokedex. Wild area is waiting for you. This is the start of a real adventure. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Very nice. An onyx, a jar of honey, a pokeball, a jar of honey. Oh, it's vanilla, or vanillite, I guess. That's Tyrogue. I don't want to fight a Tyrogue. Oh, and it's hailing. Ugh. What level are you, Tyrogue? Uh, let's see. How strong are you? Damn you! Now we're both gonna take hail damage. It's all your fault. Did they? Yeah, you can't keep using fake out, you jerk. Did they lower the damage from hail? No, it was always a 16. Wow, you aren't worth shit experience. Okay, this area is full of vanilla. Vanilla light. Oh, the camera! I have control! I'm in control. You found a note. Come here, camp here, sorry, HP. Oh! Oh! Okay. Give me those berries. Petcha and orange. Sure, three times. I think if you keep shaking it, you get attacked by something? Oh my god, it's just all vanilla? Oh my god, it is just all vanilla. -ite. Wait, there's something over there. What are you? Oh, it's a di uh, Bunnelby. And a Diggersby. Uh oh. That would be a. Actually. I wonder. Your ground type. A very strong looking Diggersby. How strong are we talking? I might be able to do this. You might just one hit KO me too. My speed. Okay, well, so much for that. I think Grookey's about to faint. Okay, well, with that, I'm going to end the episode because, dear lord, my ass is getting kicked. I shouldn't, I should have known better. Oh, I could have maybe stalled the whole fight. Okay, you know what? We'll do the camping stuff and get Grookey back up and, oh my god. We'll do it in the next episode, so thanks for joining me. Come back, I'll have the next step up real soon, but until then, bye.